hello. I'm Miss Fairy. Welcome to my kitchen. We're here for another science experiment. Today, we're doing the dancing jingle bells experiment. That would be super exciting to see. So for this experiment, it's really simple and you only need three things. Number one, you need a jar or vase. I'm using a vase today, but you want to make sure it's clear so you can see through it. The other thing you need is jingle bells. So I have some little tiny bells and I have some medium sized bells. So we can kind of experiment with these two different sizes. If you want to try a larger bell, you're more than welcome to, but I don't think it's going to work out well, but that's what science is about. Trying different things and experimenting. So if you want to give it a try, go for it. You're also going to need a carbonated beverage. I have some lemon lime soda here, so we'll want to use that. First things first, we're going to put our jingle bells inside of our jar or vase. Now, I'm kind of curious to see which size moves more, which moves faster. I think I'm going to start with the little bells first. There we go. Just putting them right there at the bottom. So you can see, I wonder if I need to move this up a little closer, maybe. Whoop, I'm okay. Let's move it up a little bit closer so you can see. Okay, how's that? That looks good. Okay, there's my jingle bells. Let me get my soda. Ugh. Ugh. Use those muscles, fairy. Okay, whoa. Oh, okay, make sure it doesn't go all over. That would be awkward. That'd be funny for you, but not funny for me. Okay, we're good. We're good. That was a close one. Okay. Um, I just left my soda at room temperature. I don't know if refrigerating will make a difference. Once again, you can experiment yourself and find out if you'd like to. All right, let's pour this in here and watch and see what happens. We're gonna pour it, oh, we'll go up. Okay, let's see, let's let it fizz out. Oh, where'd the jingle bells go? Oh, whoa! Did you see that? They went to the top and then they went plop. That was kind of cool, should we get a little more? Let's see what happens. Anything? Hmm. Are they moving? Oh, I see. Let me turn it. I don't know if you can see it. The green one was moving. Oh, there goes the red one. The green one was moving a bit. Oh, red one's dancing. Okay, now it stopped. Bubbles are moving. Hmm. Should we throw in a regular size one? Let's do it. Oh! Oh! It made a green one dance. Oh! There goes another one. Ah! There goes red and green again. Did our big red... Whoa! Did our big red one move at all? No. Sounds to me like this experiment works better with smaller jingle bells. <laughs> That's really fun when they like jump back down. I can kind of hear the bells jingle a little. Let's add some more soda, see what happens. Maybe they'll float farther up. Oh, there's one at the top. <laughs> this is really cool. I am amused by this. I hope that you guys can try this at home. It's really fun and super easy. And who knows how long it'll do this. I'm actually gonna leave this out and see if it still does this later. My light just went out. That was awkward. So, oh, I was just about to say about 15 minutes has gone by and I didn't see anything else. But as you just saw, we had another one. Oh, the big one just moved. Okay, I guess this experiment is still ongoing. Very cool. I'm gonna end mine here, but feel free to keep trying at home. See how long that they'll move. And I wonder if, I forgot I have a spoon here. I wonder if I stir it a bit. 
if that helps anything. Nope, they just spin around. Oh, there goes one. So I didn't spin, I did a back and forth motion. That got one of them up. Cool stuff. Oh, <laughs> and there it goes. I like this. I hope you like it too, and I hope you get to try it at home. Have fun.